This is a huge thrill for me. This is one of my favorite people. This is David Wolf, uh, raw food enthusiast, nutrition expert, and just like one of the weirdest and strangest uh, hippie, dippy, what do you want me to say, hippie dips? Hippie dippy trippy dudes. Just for people watching, David Wolf has plugged me into some of the weirdest and most wild stuff that I'm basically high on all day. I brought you back a very special chocolate made by a friend of mine in Cusco, Peru, and you can see right there, everybody, look at that. You can see some green powder that's in that chocolate. And it is? Coca. Cocaine? No. But this is the whole plant. This is the whole plant. You need actually about three trash bags full of that material, that, that green coca powder, in order to make one line of cocaine. Really? Yeah. This is delicious. Isn't that good? Yeah. But is this legal? No. That's why we're eating it. <laughs> Destroy the evidence, man. We gotta eat this shit before the knocks get here, man. All right, what else we got? Okay. I brought Come some on, money. Come on. What Ormus. is this? Ormus. You've been, he's been asking me, literally begging me about Ormus. This is the discovery of Ormus, that there's minerals in the environment that don't fit into the periodic table of the elements. That's the discovery. Whoa. And that's a, that's a major discovery. But what we, I did is I actually took a gold coin and we stripped out the impurities and we pushed it back into this form. I'm like a baby bird. This is LSD. <laughs> <laughs> In and pep, we can't sing that song. One thing we're going to do is we're going to go around the park here. This is a Los Angeles park, and we're going to go around, and David, who's a good forager, is going to forage for anything we could possibly eat along the way. And maybe we'll even find some weird water that we can drink, and maybe I'll die. Food is a very touchy subject, like religion, politics. It is. This is an elderberry right here, and it's actually a toxic plant, except it's berries. And just the berries, not any part of the stem, are edible. Is that Connection. FDA approved? It is definitely not FDA approved. You told me you had a friend named Raw. Yeah, oh yeah. I've and you go by that. avocado. I go by avocado. Do you have a friend named Kale? Yes. No. Yeah, his name was Caleb, is Caleb. And we just shortened it to Kale. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Didn't your website used to sell ant juice? Yeah, ant is the highest food in the world in zinc. Suck it, guys not eating ants. This is an invasive species from Chile called Nicotiana glauca. It's a tobacco. Put that in your pipe and smoke. Put that in your pipe and smoke. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna play a game called Would You Eat? I wanna see okay. how uh, hardcore you are. Okay. Uh, goji berries. Yes. Goji berries, but I didn't wash them. Yes. Goji berries, but I didn't wash them, but they're not organic. No. Okay, goji berries, they are organic. I did wash them. Yes. Okay. But I washed them in tap water. Ooh, no. <laughs> you think, well, you can't eat this grass, can you? And the answer is yes, you can. And actually, that's better for you than wheatgrass. And it tastes good. I, I ripped good. off the dirty part. <laughs> Look, I'm a cow. Instead of doing like wheatgrass that you're growing, you come out here and you get the wild grass juice. Drink that and you will be high for 12 to 14 hours. <laughs> like best time ever, rolling around on the floor giggling. Free. Yeah. Totally free. <laughs> And good for you. Uh, it is a lot of trial and error. You eat it, you see how it tastes, you see how it feels, and then six hours later, you see what it did. It's what we call the great poop experiment. Do you smoke weed? You seem like you don't smoke weed. Mm -mm. Yeah. But you're a hippie. Dude, I'm so glad we're watching this show right now. SpongeBob? The Pete Holmes show. Well, we don't want to offend most of our audience because that is a good impression of them. Would you, I know this is a silly question, but would you consider this organic? Because it's just this like, this dirt is naturally occurring, right? Yeah. God so made dirt, dirt don't hurt. Preach it. Let's play Mary <laughs> Kill, but with food. Raw chocolate, goji berries, Rice Krispie Treat. Okay, Rice Krispie Treat is obviously kill. Yep. Goji berry is because it's yeah. a female energy, and then raw chocolate Mary. It's a, the berry is a female? It's yeah. A fe it's like a Halle Berry. <laughs> that is like an A-plus joke. That was really good. That, that tastes like a leaf. C coconut butter and cacao butter mixed together 50-50 as a lube. sex oil. Sex I don't know how to say that more a sexy, gently. A sexy oil spread. A lady spread. OK, that would work. Use it as a spread for the lady who then spreads for her vagina to be penetrated by your dick that has a, has a sheep condom on it. This is not going to make it on TV. You'd be surprised. <laughs> not. We're on very late at night. A tree is actually a miniature spring. It's the same exact kind of setup. Let's steal some water. All right. Found a spring. No big deal. 
we're able to get a lot of really good, surprisingly clean and clear water. Check that out. Obviously, you weren't always this way. You're, you're now obsessed with eating the best things ever, but you grew up. I was, grew up on fruity pebbles, fruit loops, the worst stuff ever. So I thought, you know, what if I just switch to the best stuff ever? Yep. Been doing that for 25 years and it saved and my here life. Here we are, just a couple loons getting water from a park. You want me to drink this? Are you going <laughs> to? Your eyes just go black. <laughs> David, Wolf, amazing. Thank you so much. It's always a pleasure to see you. Thanks for being weird and trippy as you are. And thanks for sharing that with us. Right on. Thanks, Pete Holmes. You're the best ever. You're the best ever. Oh,